Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be going over the new lipsticks that Gucci Beauty just released. So if you are interested in hearing my thoughts and seeing my swatches on these, then just keep watching. you recall but a few years ago Gucci actually did have a beauty line I don't know what happened with it but it kind of disappeared if you will and I guess they are trying to relaunch and that is starting off with 58 different shades of new lipsticks so right now the lipsticks are only available on the Gucci website and what a launch so they just launched one product but 58 different colors and in those 58 different colors there are three different formulas now by the time that I went to order these these lipsticks there actually was not a lot left these sold out pretty quickly I just wanted to make sure I got one of each formula so I can tell you my thoughts on them this video is going to be short because I only bought three and I'm going to be completely honest with you guys I definitely only purchased these for the packaging I mean these are some of the most beautiful lipsticks I've ever seen so like I said these lipsticks are currently only available on the Gucci website and they retail for $38 each which is quite pricey it is definitely a luxury price the lipsticks are made in Italy which is a really good sign because all of my favorite lipstick formulas are actually made in Italy like the hourglass lipstick formula and the Charlotte Tilbury all of those are made in Italy so Gucci reached out over there as well so the way this works is the packaging of the lipstick indicates what type of formula it is so if it's in this blue tube it is going to be a lip balm if it's in the floral tube which is what caught my eye online this is going to be a sheer formula and if it's in this engraved golden lipstick this is going to be the satin formula and kind of in person this one is the most beautiful if you ask me but this one is also really really cute so I'm gonna start off with the lip balm formula I got mine in the shade no more orchids now the finish of this is quite glossy on the lips it is very very moisturizing which I hope it would be because it is a lip balm and it is very very sheer so you can just put a light layer on now this particular color I'm not too crazy about I think it's a bit too Barbie doll pale pink I just don't find it to be flattering for me for a lip balm like this I would prefer something a little bit more neutral and maybe not so bright because this is so sheer and the color just looks not that flattering on my skin tone so I'm personally not crazy about this color but this is a really great sheer moisturizing lip balm you can build up a tiny bit of pigment like it's going to show on your lips I will say this is a little thicker and more sticky than I would prefer I think that's kind of what you have to give up for it being so moisturizing because it does feel lovely and moisturizing on the lips I think these are going to be really great in the summer when you come out of the pool to put a little bit of brightness back into your face while also moisturizing yourself making your sunburnt lips feel a little bit better so I do like the formula of this I wouldn't say that I love it I just think it's a bit too thick for my personal preference so for me I personally don't find this formula to be worth $38 I can see where some people will like it just for me I feel like my hair is gonna stick to it and I'm just not into that so next we are going in to the sheer formula I got mine in the shade Diana Amber and it looks quite intimidating in the tube it looks like this deep plummy red color but actually on the lips it turns out to be very very sheer which is what it's supposed to be and it sh turns out a lot more bright on the lips I do really like this color I think that it starts off from a light berry color and it is a little bit biddable now you aren't going to get full opacity with this color and it's never going to end up being as dark as it looks in the tube but I think it is a really fun bright color for the summer this is quite emollient and it reminds me a lot of the lip balm but just with more pigmentation and a little less sticky so I honestly would go for the sheer colors over the lip balms I just think you get more out of it it's very very moisturizing and like I said don't feel intimidated by how it looks in the tube it's actually very sheer and I think this formula is going to be fantastic for the summer I would buy all of the bright colors in these because these are going to be great to put on without having to look in a mirror just to throw on and throw in your purse brighten up your face for the summer so I would definitely recommend 
recommend if you're going to pick these up pick them up in a fun color you're going to love this formula for the summer I can see getting a nice fun orange color looking beautiful or a fun red or berry color so I really really do enjoy this formula and this particular color too I definitely recommend and now let's hop into the painted veil first of all this packaging is everything and this color here is kind of a rosy nude shade and this is my kind of color I'm loving it that's what I have on right now as well I just have a lip liner underneath on right now but this is my kind of nude now the consistency of this is very emollient very moisturizing so all of the lipsticks in this line are going to moisturize your lips and not emphasize any lines or anything this isn't fully fully opaque it does have some sheerness to it but it is buildable and it's definitely way more opaque than the sheer formula this is very reminiscent of that moisturizing charlotte tilbury hourglass pat mcgrath formula so if you're into those kind of formulas you will definitely love this formula a lot so i'm really liking the satin formula so yes overall these lipsticks are quite pricey but it's gucci you can't expect not to pay a luxury price for these and the packaging did not disappoint for me personally the lip balm formula really isn't my favorite i would rather purchase like a fresh lip balm but the sheer and the satin formulas i think are beautiful the quality of these lipsticks are definitely in line with other lipsticks of the same price range so this is right up there with them and if you order from Gucci you're gonna get it in a nice little Gucci box I love ordering directly from luxury brands because the way they package it like that's where all your money goes the packaging I'm telling you right now so for those of you wondering yes I would definitely recommend that you go on the website and take a look at all of the colors there are a ton I don't even know where to tell you because there is 58 <laughs> it is so overwhelming luckily I had the lack of stock choose for me and for the most part I am very happy and I'm very happy that I got to experience these lipsticks so let me know if you you will be picking them up as a luxury makeup collector i am so happy to add these so thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed to my channel already i hope you take the time to do so and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys have a great day